Anthrotectonics is really simple. It's the marriage between anthro people and tectonics, which is large changes in the world happening rapidly or over a period of time, but meaningful, substantial changes in the way the world works. And the reason it's a marriage of anthrotectonics is because the changes are driven by people. It's not that the changes cause change in people. People are the drivers of anthrotectonics. And what it really means is that we are about to go into a period of large shifts when people are digitally connected because people will make choices that become visible because they're going to change the way the world works. And people are already behaving in different ways as a result of seeing how the world of digital connections changes the environment in which they choose to live. And in fact, people are using screens so much that there are people who, plenty of people who sleep with their cell phone, their smartphone next to them and wake up with it in the morning. So people will change the way the world works, the tools that are used, and the companies that lead and drive the world. And as a result, I call that anthrotechnology tectonics because when these changes happen I think in general they're going to be large they will happen sometimes slowly and sometimes quickly if you look at Twitter didn't exist a few years ago it's everywhere now so these changes will change the kinds of media the kinds of ways that we relate and the ways that we live and they'll happen as a result of what people choose